In June, hundreds of unemployed veterans gathered with potential employers to press the flesh and hand out resumes. Matthew Pizzo was one of them. After four years in the Air Force, a tour in Iraq, and armed with an undergraduate and law degree, he had gone two years without work. I've been told that I don't think you can operate in, a, uh, in this marketplace. You don't have any industry-specific experience. Uh, you've never worked under these circumstances, uh, which is a little disheartening, being that I've worked under the hardest circumstances. This week, Pizzo's search finally ended. The New York Stock Exchange, the mecca of capitalism, gave Pizzo a job and an office. Until the paperwork got signed and they said everything's done, I was, I was just waiting for the other shoe to drop, just because that's the way the whole process has been like. Pizzo got the opportunity to prove himself through the NYSE's Veterans Associate Program, an internship aimed at unemployed vets. Like many vets, Pizzo had sometimes felt HR departments didn't understand the value of his military service. Lisa Zanars Powell, the head of HR at NYSC, said HR departments everywhere are starting to understand what vets offer. Success stories such as, as Matt's is just one example of how um, a program that wasn't even on the radar and it wasn't even idea last, last summer has now come full circle and we have our first vet associate that's been hired. Pizzo doesn't regret his time in the military. He feels it gave him the strength to get through two years of unemployment. I don't regret it. It's the path I would choose a thousand times over. Uh, it shaped me into the person who's able to work here and accomplish all these things. So even though I didn't do what 99% of the country does do, um, I know that I'm able to do something that very few people are going to do at the end. So um, I wouldn't change a thing. He still has trouble believing where he works, and he knows he's fortunate. The July unemployment numbers came out Friday, and the unemployment rate for veterans of the war in Iraq continues to run higher than the national average. David Martin, Associated Press.